Remember that old trend of the US government and the media trying to reveal to the public that UFOs are real? Whatever happened with that? Is that trend still going? Well, pfft. They're years late on the bandwagon because that slobby series already told us 25 years ago that aliens do exist and that UFOs are real. Let's watch as Slobbies is visited by a UFO out of which come two aliens by the name of Fluffy. Are these aliens friendly? Well, Slobbies doesn't trust them one bit. Must you do this every morning? Oh, Slobbies, I was thinking all night about how wonderful you were last night. No problem. It's my job. No, really. You were absolutely wonderful. And to thank you, I want to let you have something today that you really want. Oh, such as? That you must tell me. Would you perhaps like to go out for ice cream? Ice cream's really delicious. Or how about we throw a party? But actually, I like the ice cream idea best. I want some. Well, there is something I would like to do today. Yes? What is it? What? I'd like to watch TV all day. Well, wonderful. Then I suppose I'll just do some wonderful laundry today. Isn't it gonna be glorious? Yay! TV all day! I won't even miss one program! Oh look, we're on the news! And so, thanks to this puppy and this fat woman, this burglar won't be stealing again for a little while. Hopefully more than 24 hours. And that's the news. You're watching channel HW, starring me! Hans Vors, tune in at 5 today for my documentary program about alien invasions from outer space. You'd be surprised at the freaky things that are happening all around us and above us. I'm not gonna tell you what it is just yet. It's a surprise. I saw a big white light. Suddenly I just couldn't move. I had lost my conscience. When I came to I was back in my bed again. Much time must have passed because the time on the clock was six hours later. They had experimented on me for six whole hours. Hmm, you're right. Six hours continuously without a rest, lunch or tea break. You know, you should join a union. At another date, Mr. Tube Test was on a trip in the desert, when suddenly he was attacked by a weird being. Could it have been extraterrestrial? I was just walking when suddenly this weird green man pounced on me! Hmm, weird green man, eh? And exactly what did this weird green man look like? He had a green face with a pointy sharp nose and funny clothes on! Well, what do you know? <laughs> Another victim described them as having pale skins with big eyes and small mouths. We asked her what exactly these experiments entail. Hello! I'm still in shock from it. I prefer not to talk about it. We'll offer you a thousand bucks for it. Well, firstly they take you to their spacecraft and put you on a table, then... This interview has been censored due to being found unsuitable for public broadcast. Sorry. There you have it, folks. If you are ever abducted by aliens, you'll probably suffer from some of the other emotional scar. It's almost like having a tattoo, just not as artistically visible. Hmm. In any case, if you are abducted by aliens, please let us know by calling 555-YAMNUTS. We'll treat it with the utmost confidentiality. Just before we tell 10 billion viewers! <laughs> Good night. Please enjoy your alien UFO nightmares. Oh, that's terrible. I hope something like that never happens to me. Who knows what they'll do to me? I am scared. Yeah, yeah, we all have our fears. Now I want to watch soaps. Excuse me? 
are coming! Can you see I'm watching the soaps? Do you think I want to be disturbed? Sorry. like a typical earthling. It looks more like somebody's pet. Let's keep looking. No! Old mom, watch out! <laughs> Look at this very lifelike statue of an earthling. Never better, never better. Uh, so have you Here. Here it seems is the best we're gonna find. A typical earthling. Oh, come on. And you called me a pet. Do you know what time it is? Experiment time! No! My dear fishy, Goldwyn fishy! No! No! Goldwyn fishy! I'll save you. I must save you. I'll do everything in my power I can to stop it! Not so loud, please! The soap is! Hmm. How do we get inside this thing? Hands up! I have the guinea fowl! So then, what is the conclusion? Conclusion? Oh no, I'm too late! Earthlings actually can survive in fluids. Wait till the guys back home hear about this. I'm coming, Goldwyn! <laughs> Hold it right there, you cruel beings! You're not gonna get away with your evil experiments! Slobby's the Great is gonna stop you! I... Wanna go get some lunch? Sure. Oh, Mom, you'll never guess what happened to us. Probably abducted by aliens. Yes, that's right. Seen it. Talk about a cliche. <laughs> 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 